Hello everyone, myself Ramesh Butlish. I am the managing partner at Fidji and center head Fidji Noida and Greater Noida Centers. Coming to the mathematics subject, you know, the math subject is generally one of the uh, uh, subjects which suddenly students fear and uh, nervous in taking, attempting this section. So my recommendations to students would be, be comfortable. The math section is going to be tricky. It's going to be tricky for everyone. You will expect some surprise questions. You can expect some lengthy and tricky questions in mathematics. But still, the chapters which I'm going to tell you, if you have prepared these questions from NCRT or even from the PYQs of JE Main, you are going to really do well in JE Main. So the chapters which are, chapter, I'll tell you topic wise, starting from coordinate geometry, solve all easy levels of questions from straight lines, circles, and at least little parabola. In coming to algebra, solve questions from progression series, binomial, complex numbers, quadratic equations, matrices, determinants, even vector algebra and 3D geometry plays a very important role. You can get a lot of questions, more than one from mat matrices, determinants, vectors and 3D. These are the questions, these are the chapters from where more than one questions have been asked in the last two to three years. Apart from this, in coming to calculus, we'll get direct questions from limits, one or two questions from area under curves and differential equation. And in case of trigonometry, you can expect some easy questions on trigonometric equations. Remembering all the ratios and identities in trigonometry will help you fetch some good marks even in this section. So my recommendation to students would be attempt all the easy levels of questions and try to score, save, time, save some time from chemistry and physics and invest that time in solving the numericals of mathematics. When you're doing time management, try to score some more questions from chemistry in the fact-based section save some time from chemistry and physics invest that time in mathematics if you really want to do well in mathematics section now this section is going to be slightly lengthy considering the previous year trends coming to the j e main mathematics section as you are aware that direct questions could be asked in physics and chemistry but in case of mathematics there could be some intermingling of concepts of more than two chapters so my suggestion to students would be to avoid selective study in coming to mathematics here you must also expect some surprises in terms of assertion reasoning kind of questions some kind of statement one statement two the best statement matched could be the correct answer so here you can expect some surprises in terms of the pattern of questions which are going to be asked some lengthy questions could be there so here save time from the previous subjects and invest a time in mathematics section so in maths be careful with your calculations because it's a numerical section and also do not do select, selective study because here selective study may land you in some kind of trouble when you get questions intermingling of concepts of two to three chapters in a particular question so my advice is avoid selective study and prepare all the chapters at the NCRT level, of course, solving questions from every chapter. Even from chapters like statistics and probability, you can expect some direct questions from NCRT. So remember all the important vital formulas, because these formulas are very, very crucial. It will save your time and attempting a question. So as students must be aware that the JE main exam could be taken in two sessions in a particular academic year. However, a student can attempt the JE main in three consecutive academic years. But my suggestion for students would be to give the January attempt as the best attempt. In case students who are focused for JE advanced must not wait till the April attempt. Once you have given your best shot in January, got a score percentile more than 98, 99, you can start focusing in your JE advanced exam post this. Students who fail to qualify for get, get through above 98 percentile or you know they are feeling that they have not done their best in the January attempt can still prepare in these next two months and take the April attempt confidently. For students who are taking the J main for the first time need not worry. The best of the two attempts in a particular academic year is considered for the J main merit list. So in case something goes wrong, you're not able to give your best shot in the January attempt. Only then you should take the April attempt. And for students who have already done the best performance in the January attempt can start focusing for their J advanced exam and even they can comfortably take their board exams. From breaking news, detailed analysis, in-depth interviews, and explainers. 
follow the times of india subscribe to our youtube channel don't forget to like our videos and hit the bell icon to stay updated with the latest